Welcome back to a brand new video, and today <clears throat> I'm going to be expressing my opinions on why I am worried about the Conjuring Universe. Yes, I am worried about the Conjuring Universe. Before I get into the video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Please subscribe and hit that little notification bell to know when I upload a brand new video or even go live. Sometimes that notification bell works. My goal is 50 subscribers by my birthday, so let's see if we can get to 50 subscribers by my birthday. Let's get it. So, <clears throat> why I'm worried about the Conjuring universe, let me break it down for you. The Conjuring, a great movie. The Conjuring, love The Conjuring. Conjuring 2, loved it even more. Annabelle, I loved it. Have nitpicks, but loved it. Annabelle Creation 2, loved it. The, the Nun, hated The Nun. Let me get to that. The Nun, to me, was boring. It was too slow. It was very sluggish. And I'm a huge fan of slow-paced films. The Exorcist, Child's Play, Psycho, Friday the 13th. There's many, many horror movies that do slow boil justice. The Nun did not. The Nun took place about halfway in, in, in a forest, basically. Um, I probably will never review the nun. I will get the I will get the nun on Blu-ray. I might review it for you guys. I don't know. I might just get it on Blu-ray to have it in my collection, but not watch because I don't. I did not enjoy the nun. The, 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 the nun to me was very boring and very bland to me. And yeah, it made a lot of money, but it also got me thinking. It also got me thinking. Um, because the nun, it made a lot of money, but some fans did not like it. Some fans didn't. Some fans liked. Some fans liked it, loved it, hated it, whatever you want to call it. My thought is, um, there's going to be a, a Conjuring franchise for T. There's going to be a Conjuring franchise for T. That's what happened in the eighties. With the slashers, that was a fatigue. Then they didn't know what to do with the characters. So I feel like there's going to be a fatigue where they call, you know, there's this Conjuring universe is awesome, but they get getting to that point of what they did with the slashers where there's a, going to be a fatigue and they don't know what to do with these characters. And to me, that's kind of worrying. And Annabelle looks like this called suck. Annabelle looks like this called suck. For multiple reasons, I'm not hyped for the new Annabelle. I'm worried about it, and I feel like the new Annabelle is going to be an opening eye for a lot of fans of the Conjuring universe. That this franchise is dying out, it's burned out. They got nothing new because the Annabelle, the Annabelle has powers and all this. So I do feel like the that's why I, that's why I am worried about the Conjuring universe is because they're running out of ideals. Which why are they running out of ideals? There's so many books, interviews, stories they could pull from. But no, the whole start coming up with random ideals and stuff, and just burn out the franchise, and so that's why I'm worried about the Conjuring universe. It's starting to a burnout point and a fatigue point. That's what killed the slashers, you know, in the mid '80s and the, you know, mid '90s was they didn't know what to do with the characters. They was they were starting onto a fatigue. So if you do agree with me, let me know in the comments below. Give me a big thumbs up. Please subscribe. Catch everyone in this video. Peace.